Wave 7. How many waves did we get through last night anyway? Wasn't it like uh, 18 15. or something? We stopped at 15. Oh, uh, okay. Do you think we'll see the uh, chick back from the Vindicators? Yeah. I don't know. When I saw like all the, I, like I looked at all the minions for uh, the World Ender. I'm like, why are they all in sexual position? Wait a minute. <laughs> I'm like, who would do that, Rick? See, it was funny because I caught on that it might be Rick. But then when they showed the, uh, you know, the hollow screen coming down. Right. I was like, oh, maybe it's another Rick. Yeah, actually, you know who I thought it was? Evil Rick. Yeah. I like, like, I saw Rick die. I'm like, dude, Evil Rick's back. Nope. It's just drunk Rick. I was hoping it was going to be, like, Even Evil worse. Rick or, uh, one of the Ricks from, um, the council. The council. Coming back for vengeance. Yeah, and I was expecting it to be like this whole like, oh, you like fucked up all our shit. Now we're here to fucking destroy you. Nah. Drunk Rick just wants to have fun. Hey, dude, he made like a whole party while fucking drunk. Like, shit himself drunk. That's being pretty impressive. I was so drunk, I organized a party. And I created Saw. Now, who would do Saw? Like, Saw! Oh, shit. I made a neutrino bomb. Where's the lead yeah, wire? Got... What kind of neutrino bomb is this? Yeah, it was kind of, it was kind of a bit Morty when I made that. Fucking ninjas. God. So if they didn't uh, do the entire thing, wouldn't they blow up everyone at the party? Yeah. Including, like, uh, Beth and Summer? Yep. Okay. Ogre! So... If you were to give Rick a D and D class, what would it be? Artificer. Yeah. Yeah, he'd be an inventor. Okay. Now, what about Morty? Commoner. I was thinking Bard. Really, Bard? Yeah, because he kind of inspires Rick to do shit. Don't mind me just coming over here upgrading your shit. Yeah, we good. Almost wasn't. It kept marching down, I would have been good. Yeah, I can see him as a bard. Because he kind of inspires, you know, Rick and Beth and Summer. And even Jerry. What would Jerry be? Commoner. I don't know, though, because Jerry has his moments. When? Give me one instance. When he was a slug. <laughs> I, yeah, because of evil bath. Can't argue with that logic. Well, he wasn't. He was complete submissive. Which is why evil Beth wanted him. Even though he did pop someone's head off, so. I don't know. I can see either commoner or like. Commoner. 
<laughs> no, you know who he'd be? He'd be a wizard that would always have the wrong spells made. <laughs> uh, oh, I, I don't have that spell. God damn it, Jerry. You know that's true. That is very true. Just be that wizard that just happens to have the greatest spell that you need, but didn't have it ready. Oh, I got prismatic wall. Yes, yes. Oh, it, it's not prepared. It's a three hour. I didn't prepare. prepare. Why didn't you fucking prepare? We told you we needed it. I didn't think we needed it. God damn it, Jerry. From now on, whenever you guys fuck up, I'm going to start calling y'all Jerry's. Oh, that's just me. I know. So, I have no idea what's going on this Friday. Neither do I. Well, I actually do know what's going on this Friday. Yeah, you got to go home. Is it what? Because you got to go home. Yeah. Whose game is it? Mine. What is? Yeah. Oh, it's going to be Shauna's. No, it's mine. Like, even Shauna thinks it's Shauna's. Huh. Since, since we didn't do it last week? Yeah, this would be Shauna's week, actually. Go away, ninjas. I can't handle you. Go, ninja. Go, ninja. Go. Away. And, of course, an ogre is back. And I may need help on him. I don't see no ogre. Uh, yeah, there's an ogre coming. Oh, I see him. He's kind of dazed and confused in the back. He's kind of running around. What the? Wait, I got ninja problems. Dude, I get spread too thin in this map. What would Mr. Poopy Butthole be? He'd be a bard. Ooh, let me sing you a song. Or oh, Mr. that reminds me. I have a, uh, I have a question for you. What? In the one commercial, in one of the uh, commercial episodes, they had another like Mr. Poopy Butthole character named Steely, right? Yeah. Well, it does well going by that information. That means that their names are based on what they do. Okay. Then oh, what? Okay. What would Mister Poopy Butthole be known for? I'm getting either a rapey kind of feeling or just he poops everywhere. I think he smells like shit all the time. Yeah, true. There's no way could he be that fantastic without a giant flaw. That's like a huge flaw, though. That's not even like. Yeah, you kind of the guys. That's like, oh my god. That's like, that's like a butters kind of flaw. What's wrong with butters? She can't fit through a van door. Oh, that butter! I thought you were talking about <laughs> like South Park butter. You said no. butters, so I'm like butters. What's wrong with butters? Nothing's wrong. He had with his butters. own episode and everything. Yeah, it's butters. That's me. Oh, oh. I got cheesy popcorn. I hear that. Yeah. Sir, you're not allowed out of your room till you quit making that face. What face? That face! Oh, but this is my regular face. Don't you lie to me, boy. I did like the uh, My Little Cthulhu episode. I did not watch that episode. I haven't watched South Park in forever. Really? It's a yeah. giant three-part episode where they explain, like, how Kenny does what he does, like, dies all the time and comes back. Is and... it some weird Cthulhu power? No. Well, maybe. Kind of. Um, but Cartman befriends Cthulhu. And it, turns, reasons. And it turns into a giant, um, spin-off of My, uh, My Name with Totoro. 
and it's My Neighbor Cthulhu. Uh, geez. And I do like the little cutesy, like, little, like, where he paws up Cthulhu and shit like that. Yeah, no, it's absolutely great. You gotta watch it. I don't think I want to. If I'm correct, it actually leads up into the Stick of Truth. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm waiting to watch someone play the uh, new next game. The new what game? The new game. I kind of wanted to get it because apparently that one touches on the actual episode. Oh, it touches on a lot of things. I bet it does. Saddam. Saddam. What are you doing? We last game. waiting on you. Yeah, I'm, I'm up in my stuff. You upgrading to some shit? I'm upgrading shit. Well, I thought I clicked on something and ended up giving myself something I didn't want. Oh. you leveling up over there and shit. You know, I'm level 42. Good job. Well, it's endless ways, man. Soon I'll be level 70 and be able to use that shit. And this is not hard, isn't it? Yeah. I'm in all kinds of XP. Because we were playing on normal. A bad ninja. I know I got talking to Steve about alien shit. He, it was interesting. Like alien versus predator kind of alien or alien. No, no, like like, like fifty one. Oh yeah, what about? Uh, he doesn't believe. He believes all uh, religion is a form of control. Uh huh. Essentially. And his whole thing is that we're this not as a species as a species we're not being upset at the big boy table on the alien the Galactic Federation. I I believe that. Of course he's had encounters with the aliens, he claims, so it's like Like I was talking to Jeremy today and was and we were talking about like some weird uh some uh I was watching a video and a dude it was a about a nine one one call to a dude that Supposedly saw Bigfoot in his yard. Yeah. He didn't say it was Bigfoot. He just said, like, there's some dude in my yard. So we started talking about that. He's like, have you experienced any, like, weird, not that kind of thing? I'm like, no, not really. Something that can't be easily explained away. Yeah. Like, everyone around me has had some weird paranormal shit happen to them, and me, I'm just sitting there going, you guys are crazy. That sucks, man. Oh my God, I'm Rick. I'm Jerry. That's who I am. <laughs> well, fuck, I'm Jerry. It'll be okay, Jerry. I won't be always sent to an intergalactic... Uh, Bolt daycare. You can leave whenever you want. Yeah, but I'm not a bitch like Jerry, so. Got my glob glob? <laughs> 